Good morning, folks. Good morning, hustlers and hustlets. Um, today, man, I want to talk about energy, man. Um, energy, as in that thing that can't be created nor destroyed. That thing that we call a vibe. You know what I'm saying? Energy. When it comes to life, you have to have a certain energy when you are you are expecting a specific goal to be accomplished. And sometimes there will be people who are placed in your life who have the total opposite um, energy um, as you. Sometimes these people are already in your life. What I'm going to tell you, though, listen, if you if you want to um, accomplish specific goals and if you want to grow, you'll be very careful, very careful um, about what energy you allow in your circle. Um, for instance, uh, I may be a fucking serial killer and you may be an entrepreneur. Our energies don't match. But while, say if you give me a ride, you feel me? Not knowing that I already have a warrant out for me, for my arrest. I brought that energy to your life. You get pulled over, they go to warrant. You feel me? Or you get caught up in one of my bullshit um, adventures and you get arrested with me. It's not because you did anything, but it's because of the association of the energy. So you got to be very careful who you allow uh, around your energy, who you allow around your circle, who you, um, you got to be very careful who you consider a friend, an associate, um, um, a lover. You have to be very careful. And you can just, you can read people's energy. When, when you meet them, when you meet an individual, you have this thing called a vibe. Uh, a lot of people be like, oh, I don't like his vibe. Um, or he has a good vibe. He has a, he has a, a, a great vibe about him. She, she has a great vibe. That, that vibe, that's your intuition telling you, okay, well, this is his energy. Judge him by his energy. Do not judge him by what he say. D judge him by his, if you can't judge him by his energy, judge him by his ab habits. Because as humans, we can't override our habits. Uh, we automatically act on them. So if you really want to know what someone is up to, chill with them for at least 30 days, a month. Um, and these people, because if your habit these people habits are so strong within the 30 days they'll be they'll be slipping up and they'll show you who they are uh automatically you just have to watch because there's no way that they can change they can be on top of the pattern and um they can um alter the pattern all the time but when it comes down to it man watch your energy watch the people that surround you watch the people that you call friend Watch the people that you call associate. Watch the people that you call your girlfriend, your boyfriend. Watch your wife, your husband. Watch everything. Be observant. Because at the end of the day, your life is your life. And you're the only one that's held accountable for your life. Not your mom, not your dad. Um, not your friends. You. So watch your energy. The law of association. If you hang with five broke niggas, you you're gonna be the sixth. If you hang with four broke niggas, you're gonna be the fifth. Um, if you if you hang with five people who have fucked up tempers, you're gonna be the sixth. And that's all I gotta say for today. Real motivation for real people.